welcome to the project of ICU patient health monitoring system through IOT. So here we are going to monitor the patient health parameters like a heartbeat and a pulse oximeter we will be getting from this sensor this max 30100 and the temperature will be getting from this LM35 temperature sensor and these three parameters will be given from the Atmega microcontroller to the Raspberry Pi and the same data will be monitored on the LCD screen and the parameters will be sent to the cloud platform like IOT uh, ThinkSpeak so through this Raspberry Pi 0W so from there uh, we are going to get the parameters and we can get the data logging also in that uh, ThinkSpeak app uh, so before switching on this kit we need to do some initial settings in a phone so like uh, we need to enable the hotspots with this mentioned name of project 45, uh, 4353 and uh, then uh, enable the hotspot along with data so just uh, open the hotspot settings in a phone and uh, on the hotspot so it should be 4353 three. no space and all should be small letters only and a password 12345689 and okay then enable the hotspots and also data so after that switch on the kit okay so once uh, you switch on the kit before that just place the finger on this SPO2 sensor in order to get the live data directly and uh, so initially it will take some time for the booting and by the Raspberry Pi and uh, the data will be welcome message will be displayed on the LCD screen and we will get the live heart rate SPO2 and the temperature and coming to the interfacing connections the max 30100 interface at A4 A5 pin of the Atmega and uh, LM35 interface at A0 so why we are using this microcontrol nothing but uh, as we know that Raspberry Pi doesn't have the inbuilt ADC like we got the uh, parameters you can see the heart rate and SPO2 and the temperature and through the phone internet the Raspberry Pi will send the data to the ThinkSpeak we will show you that and uh, coming to the interfacing connections as I said A4A4 A4 interface to the max and A0 uh, for the LM35 and uh, TXRX of the Atmega controller pins given to the TXRX of uh, Raspberry Pi 0W and from here we are going to decode the data and the data will be displayed on the LCD with the help of uh, Raspberry Pi 0 only and here using the Pi 0W is nothing but inbuilt wireless communication uh, Wi-Fi and uh, from here we are going to provide the 5 volts power supply to the Pi 0 and it will distribute the power supply to this board and from here we are going to distribute the same power supply to the Max as well as LM35 sensor so let us see the uh, output on the ThinkSpeak. So just log into the ThinkSpeak with the given credentials and we can see the live parameters directly which can send the parameters to the ThinkSpeak uh, for every 15 seconds of duration. As we know that ThinkSpeak will uh, accept the data for 15 seconds of duration only. So coming to this uh, ThinkSpeak, so right, so we got the live data here, right. So it is keep on sending the data. So the heart rate, the live data, you can check the timings. And uh, this is the temperature and this is the pulse oximeter. So it will be continuously feeding the data. Uh, it will store in this uh, Excel sheet format. If you want to clear this data, just uh, go to channel settings and uh, clear channel. Before that, clear channel, just you, uh, you need to download this data. So download. So the data will be downloaded and stored in CSV file. So we can uh, access this data. Right. So now the CSV data will be uh, displayed. And after downloading that, so you can clear the channel. So right. So this is the data included along with the date and time. So just now go to channel settings and uh, clear channel in order to clear the old data done the data was cleared only clear channel don't do delete the channel and don't do any other changes and just you can see the live data will be appear now the previous data will be erased so after a prescribed time of 10 to 15 seconds the live data will be sent to the thing speak through the mobile phone internet <coughs> yeah right thank you for watching demo